by Christmas hopefully we don't have too much of a wet winter even though we need a wet winter especially in the regional areas for farms and things like that I hope that the city doesn't get too much rain because I want my home for Christmas we're actually just talking to Matt's dad yesterday about the furniture that we need to build yes I'm still gonna vlog them sometimes building the furniture I probably won't have too much of a huge part of it wow bud um, show you guys the process I need to start looking at patterns and things like that on Pinterest of the things that I like and that I want and then I have to look into a little bit more of materials that I want I think I want to go with oak furniture if you've built with oak furniture in the past or built with oak timber in the past I should say um, let me know if there's anything that we should know because I don't think that stat has even built with oak before um, yeah that is that is what we're up to at the moment Matt is crazy busy at work he's got two weeks off in next week um, to start building the retaining wall so that is gonna happen soon I think we're all just highly stressed highly overworked highly tired and just just going out of our minds um, it's been stressful I'm not gonna say it's been happy families because I know that you guys all know when you build a house there are some tensions but I think we've done pretty well I have my car back I don't know if I even mentioned to you guys that the clutch went in my car so I had to get a new clutch but yeah that is pretty much where we're up to I'm gonna stop chatting your ears off and we will see you guys at the house You guys, we made it to Bunnings Crafts for the first time in what feels like forever. Sam is having a play before crafts this morning because we are here super early. Um, the builders or the demo guys were awesome. They were top guys. If you are looking for a demolition company in Adelaide, then I'll have a link down below to their company. It's called Gala Demolition. They were super friendly, super helpful, and just really awesome guys. That was just really, really helpful. So I'm really happy with how that's going. What were you doing?
been a long day. We ended up heading out to Kmart today, so keep your eye out for a Kmart haul. I am in the process of cooking dinner. You can see all my crazy mess here. We're actually making tonight um, Spanish, what's it called? Spanish style beef with capsicum and potatoes. I love um, making different recipes and things like that. You guys know that. So that's what we're having for dinner tonight. I'm trying to get it done before Matt gets home. Sam is going to be hanging out with Nani tonight and Matt and I are going to be meeting stump removal guys and post hole diggers. That's what I've been doing this afternoon. I've been trying to organise a stack of crazy things for next week. Next week we're building a retaining wall. Um, so I'm trying to coordinate everything while also not knowing what the heck I'm even doing. So. It's been a crazy day. We are getting there though. We are going to survive. I'm gonna get this dinner cooked. Matt will be home shortly to eat and then we are gonna head off. So we'll show you guys the house and the progress the demolishers got through today when we get there. Oh my gosh, you guys, there is a massive hole in our house. We've just met with all the tradies that are going to be coming next week to help us out. This is insane. <sighs> Look at that. I don't even think we should be in here, but we're just going to have a whirl. You left a shoe here. Yeah, I know. I didn't want that shoe. Oh my gosh. This See is... what that stuff? See what that is? Asbestos stuff? Yeah. yeah. We probably shouldn't be here. Holy moly. Oh my gosh. Oh what, that window is gone too. This is crazy guys, <laughs> it feels so weird. I'm sorry, I was gonna try and part with this, but I can't. <laughs> I don't know what it is, I'm such a hoarder when it comes to Sam's artwork, I am not getting rid of any of it. I'm, I'm gonna be one of those old ladies that has a room dedicated to my kids' artwork. until we looked at the next house next door and it had completely been gutted. It is crazy. I'll have to tell Matt about that later. We are on our way up to the old house. It is currently about 7 a.m. It's quarter past seven. Um, we're going there to meet a stump removal guy. Hopefully he gets there earlier. I sent him a message last night asking him to come a little bit earlier. We did this up too early to even talk. We did discuss um, meeting there at at eight, eight. Um, but I'm worried that the demo guys are gonna get there and see him and technically we're not allowed on the site. So to bring in another contractor, we're not really supposed to be doing that. So I'm hoping that he gets there super early and he's just got two smaller stumps to get rid of. So hopefully he'll be done in like 30 minutes and we can just get out of there before anyone realizes we're there. But that is our morning this morning and then we're gonna head over to a place
place and sells fences because we need to quit up the fence that goes on top of the retaining wall this morning. Um, I need to give the neighbours their costing for their half of the fence. I don't know what it's like around the world, but um, in Australia, when you put a new fence up, generally the neighbours go 50-50. Um, we're very lucky that the neighbour that we're going 50-50 with is very handy and he's also a welder. So um, hopefully the guys can build the fence, no dramas together, uh, compared to us having to pay for labour. So we're going to save some money there. And then we're going to go and do some crafts because we had so much dang fun yesterday. We want to do it again today. Um, so we're going to do that and then we're going to go home and bake some cupcakes today because we have a lot of people to thank. This past week has been crazy. We've got to thank the mechanics that fixed my car. We want to thank um, the tradies that are demolishing our house. We're going to build them some build bake them some cupcakes for morning tea tomorrow and then I think we're also going to bake a batch of cupcakes for Matt's team at work because they've all been working so hard lately and we just want to thank everybody around us and in our life that is making our life well I wouldn't say easier at the moment but they're helping us so that is our morning what do you think babe it's a bit different Awesome. Is there a big hole in the window? Yeah. And a big hole in the roof? Should we go see what the guy's doing out the back? Yeah. yeah. Uh, look. It's very dirty, isn't it? Yeah. Gotta watch where you're going. Lightning strikes by my window. It's my chest. Guys, we have so many trucks in this street. This little guy doesn't know which one to look at. Is that the coolest thing ever, bud? Are you excited? It's a good day, isn't it, when you get to see so many trucks? You guys, ah. we just got our quote ah. for our fin thing. Uh, it, um, ah. it came in what we thought ah. it was going to, which was really ah. good. just been up back up back up back basically I just got a phone call from our builders and they were saying something about how our retaining walls haven't been approved but they have been approved and it's something to do with council and our house hasn't been approved so we're just gonna go straight to the council and try and sort it out because I think it's just easier to do it in person and talk about the issues face to face when there's a whole bunch of people trying to organize one thing things can be miscommunicated and things like that so I think it's best just to go there sort it out in person, find out what the issue is and get it sorted real, real fast rather than emails back and forth. So that is where we're headed now. Poor Sambo, he, he has to do the run around with us, don't you buddy? Yeah, we just want to go have some fun. Maybe we can go to a playground after. What do you think? Yeah? Oh, playground. 
Oh, it's not too hot now because it's not summer anymore. Huh? It's it's not summer anymore, so we can go there and play. It won't be too hot. Do you want to go on the playground? Okay. Yeah. So we're going to go and sort this stuff out, hopefully, fingers crossed, and then go for a quick drive past the house, see if the demo guys are there and if they're doing anything today. I have a feeling they're not going there today. I feel like they're demolishing the house tomorrow. I, I could be wrong, but I feel like they've done everything that they can possibly do already until they bring in the... Is it not hot on your hands? Yeah. No, not today. Not hot on your hands today. Yeah, because it's nice and cool today, isn't it? Yeah. The playground's only hot on your hands when, when it's hot outside. Yeah. Yeah. So that is the plan. We're going to try and do that. I feel so tired. Let me just... Oh, my gosh. And I feel really, really bad for Matt. He didn't sleep very well last night. I feel like this stress is just... They do say that building a house can, can basically send you to the night house. So I think we're halfway there already. But... I'm sure we can work through it and with positive mindset we can um, overcome all these little hurdles. But for now we're going to go up there and fingers crossed. Oh my gosh, I'm looking like a right mess right now. It is 6 o'clock, I'm about to start cooking dinner. We've been home for a few hours. I was able to do a little bit of housework. Did not get dishes done but I am going to try and get them finished tonight along with a load of washing. Um, we sorted out the issues. It was a septic tank and the fact that when I drew the plans for the retaining wall, I drew it right to the back of the yard and I said that we we're going to bench the back of the yard and that wasn't included in the building company's plans. So they're just changing their plans. They're going to resend them off hopefully in the next few days. At this stage, the guy said that we should be approved in the next four weeks and that the... Building should happen sometime around the 10th of May. That's when they should start. So, fingers crossed that's when it happens and we can get things started. I'm excited. Hey guys, thank you so much for taking some time out of your day to watch some of ours. If you want to see more from us, make sure you click here to subscribe. If you want to keep up to date with our house build, then click here. And to watch all of our latest videos, click here.